Well, we better get going. We got a big day ahead of us. We don't have any work going on. We're just gonna have a fun day. And the first things first, we're heading down to a police auction. You know, our daily goal is to try to make as much money as possible in the hopes that eventually we save up a million dollars, but not every day we're gonna do that. We're gonna start having some fun and not always just worry about money. First things first, let's get a little muddy on our way down to the police station, yes sir. Here we go, hit a little jump. Yee! It's a little Dukes of Hazard jump right there. All right, let's keep her moving. Here we go, 95, 100. Oh, the old Cummins. She's still got a little kick in her step. And I think the station, it's kind of a remote one. It should be right up ahead. My phone says, oh, yep, there we go. Wow, okay, let's pull out of the way. I don't want to take up all the parking spots. All right, this is a little intimidating. Just a bunch of cops. Nice to meet you. My name is Spencer, and I'm here for the police auction, or sheriff auction. Okay, this must be the only thing you have for sale. That's all I saw online as well. Pretty sweet, man. What the heck? Why would police officers need these? I guess that's why you're selling it. All right, the interior is super clean. I love the bench seats. It just feels feels great. Feels awesome. You can fit a bunch of people in here. It's old school. The dash, the clusters, oh, everything. Roll up windows, of course. All right, 75,000 miles. Not terrible. They really kept good care of it. Four on the floor. That's important. Four wheel drives now. Just go out. And you can fit more people in the back. So this is pretty sweet. And the sheriff just said I'm the only, only one to show up for the auction. The rest is online. Well, since I'm the only one here bidding on it, Sheriff just said to get in his cop car and use the internet. That way it's even for everybody. All right, we'll boot up the computer and hopefully we win it. And there we go. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I was the only one bidding on it. And the reserve price was $5,000. So we got an amazing deal on this. It runs and drives. Everything works just fine. Now that we got the keys, let's go ahead and fire her up. All right, Sheriff, here's the 5,000 bucks. And I was wondering, is there any chance you could, you know, drive my truck home? I didn't bring another person and, well, I didn't know I was gonna get the truck in the first place. All right, let's have some fun. Today's gonna be a good day. We're gonna go, I'm for sure taking this thing mudding, one of the first things I'm gonna do. And the goal is I got this cheap, five grand. Now, five grand, still five grand, but it's worth a lot more than that. And we're gonna have a great time in it. Now I can't do too much of crazy stuff cause they got Sheriff right behind me. But once, once we're done, once he leaves, we're gonna go speeding. We're gonna do some crazy stuff in this thing. Well, thanks for driving it back, Sheriff. Oh, you absolutely love the truck? Yeah, no, this is a great truck. I'm letting Sheriff go and mudding in my truck. He said, well, it's already muddy. What, what else is it gonna do? Oh my goodness, he's going, he's going for it. He's going for the jump. Holy biscuits. He landed it, kind of. Oh gosh, hopefully Sheriff doesn't get hurt, but he should be having a good time. Let's jump in the F-800 and we'll try and chase him down. I think boss man was in the little office there when we pulled in. I think he's doing some computer work. He's missing out. Here we go. We're hitting the big jump. Yes, sir. Oh, this thing hits jumps perfectly. Oh, the, well, not perfect, but that was pretty dang good. All right, come around the corner. This thing is kind of top heavy. We don't want to dip it, but today is a great day so far. We're having a lot of fun. Come on, baby. Hit the jump. Watch out, Sheriff. Coming in hot. <laughs> yes, sir. There we go. Last little mud bit, make the corner. This thing doesn't get too muddy. I think it's just so high up off the ground. And sweet, we're finishing. Let's go check up on Boss Man, see what he's doing. There he is. Boss Man, <laughs> were you doing some computer work there? I was, what's up? I saw there was a cop here. Yeah, sure. some walk away? Uh, yeah, he left. I think a buddy came and picked him up, but I just bought this F-800 truck. What the heck? Why did you buy this thing? I bought this thing because, you know, we spent a little too much time trying to make as much money as possible. I thought, let's go buy a truck. I paid five grand for it at a police auction. That's why Sheriff was around here. Oh, okay. I thought you were in trouble or something. No, no, no. He just drove it for me and I was like, hey, this is going to be a toy. Let's go have some fun. This isn't for the dealership? This is not for the dealership. If it survives today's endeavors, we'll put it on the dealership, make some money, but most likely it won't see tomorrow. Okay, let's have some fun. And here we are. The first test for this truck is we're going to put a couple thousand pound rocks in the back. Boss man beat me here. He's tearing it up. Boss man, jump in that wheel loader. Get me loaded up. Oh, don't have to tell me twice. Come on. All just right. Hey, watch my back window. Oh, geez. You're putting the whole weight on here. Uh, you said this truck's for fun, right? Well, it just survived the front of the wheel loader on this. Okay. How's, it, how's that one handling in there? Strap her down. I think we're good. Well, there's another one here, man. I do see that. Why don't you go ahead, get underneath it, and if I feel like it, we might load her up. Man, we have to. You said this thing is being pushed to the limits. Did you not? All right, all right. You got me. Let's load her up. All right, drop her down. 
Okay. You ready with those straps? Get out, get out, pull out. There we go. I'm trying. Drive out. Uh, go. Got it. How is that thing pulling that? This thing's a beast, baby. All right, Holy check this out. Smoke. We're gonna do some of my favorite driving. Oh, jeez. Oh, you might want to do donuts the other direction. Actually, I think this direction is the best. I don't scrape the side of my truck. But you're gonna. Oh, okay. I guess that's true. But if you do it the other way, it should balance out. Yeah, possibly. There we go. We got a couple of the wheels off. Oh, yes. Oh, I didn't see that jump. All right, man. She hauls some huge rocks. This is pretty crazy. Ford built tough right here. Here we go. See how the suspension handles it. No, oh, I'm going to be following behind, oh, man. Oh, that was sweet. Those guys said they need these rocks delivered down to the bottom of the quarry, so that's what we're doing. Spencer? Yep. Your truck ran out of fuel. Yeah, that's your problem. Uh, it sounds like you're a problem. Looks I'll like just you're walking here. home. Here we go. Unloading the rocks. And perfect. Couple hill climbs here. Won't hurt nobody. Yes, sir. All right, boss man. I think I'm ready to take this thing on a top speed run. How fast can it actually go? You got it whenever you buy a new car. Well, you don't have to, but it is cool to know. How fast are we going? 45, 55. Floor it, floor it, floor it. Eee! There we go. We kind of didn't land it, but this thing's a beast. It'll be just fine. Well, we left Boss Man behind, but I still want to see what this thing can do top speed. So we're going to go right through the middle of town. Probably not the, the best spot to do it, but hey, I'll look pretty cool doing it. Here we go. Take the corner. We're going 45, 55. We're getting up speed, 65. Watch out, pedestrians are taking up the middle of the road. Move it or lose it. We're going 80, 85. Come on, hit 90. This thing's starting to top out. Oh, we barely got 90. Oh, no, there's a cop. Oh, jeez. Didn't see that thing. I was looking at my speedometer to see how fast we were going. Oh, he's on me. He is. He's he's catching up. And I'm going super fast. Oh, no, guys. This thing can't even hit 100 mile an hour. He's easily going to get me. Shut it off. Shut it off. There he goes. He's going. By. Oh, no. How did he see me? Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. How did he know? Maybe it's my red paint job. Those trees weren't too, you know, they weren't blocking too well. Uh oh, guys, this guy, no, he's not a sheriff. He's not the sheriff, but he probably knew this thing was a sheriff vehicle. So he's, it's probably easy to figure out who the heck I am. Oh, no, guys, we're in trouble. Probably shouldn't have been speeding. Now, here's the question. Do I keep running from him? Oh, gosh. Oh, no, he got me. Wait, wait a second. Just for fun. Let's, there we go. Flip back over. All right, it's your turn, buddy. Move it or lose it. That's what you get. You don't mess with Big Spence. Oh, no, he flipped over. I was just about to go to his window. Oh, jeez. Wait, it is, Sheriff. Sheriff, I'm sorry. Sheriff, I am sorry. Oh, bam, I am sorry. Excuse me, excuse me. All right, all right, all right, all right. Quit roughhousing me. I give up, I give up. Back off. Okay, okay, I, hands by my back. I, I got you, I got you. Well, guys, looks like we're going in jail today. Ma'am, I'm not I'm not resisting anymore. I, I, I give up. You got me fair and square. Well, the transport truck arrived, and we are going back to the police station that we started today off at, where we bought the truck. Oh gosh, I shouldn't have been speeding. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That was a dumb mistake. I got it. I was having a little too much fun. So that's my mistake. We're gonna have to pay some money to him to get out. I get to spend the night in jail, it sounds like, and I might have my license revoked. Do I get my one phone call? Where do I get my phone call? All right, come back here. You'll give, okay, fair enough. Yep. How long do I get? One minute to call? Okay, thank you. Let's see, call boss man. Here we go. Boss man, this is Spencer. What's up? Why, what's, what's this phone number? Uh, yeah, I'm in. I'm at the police station. What? Yep. Like, you're getting a new vehicle? You know how I was like, hey, I want to see how fast the truck goes? Well, I was going 100 mile an hour right back, cop. Are you kidding me? So, yeah. No, I'm not kidding you, but I am in the police station. I need you to come bail me out, and I think that's it. They, they want to keep me overnight, and you got to bail me uh, out in the morning. Man. I'll pay you back. Okay, I guess I'll be there in the morning. What time can I come? 6 a.m. 6 a.m.? You want me up at 6 a.m.? Yeah. Okay, fine. Fine, fine. I'll be there. <laughs> hey, Spencer, you in here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You here? Yeah. Hey, man, Let what the out. heck? Get me out of here. Man, you are ridiculous. Come on. Open it up, dude. I'm trying. The button's not working. Here we go. All right. Thanks for what? bailing me out of jail, man. I appreciate heck. it. You owe me $5,000. That's how That's much what the it bail costs. costs. What? Yeah, bro. You, these cops, what did you do to them? They did not like you. Well, yeah, I bought their truck. They had an auction yesterday, bought it, did a bunch of, you know, we were having fun with it, whatever. And the sheriff mm -hmm. actually liked me. And the next thing you know, I drove by a sheriff and they pulled me over. You know, I ran from them a little bit, but they sent you with one of their vehicles and flipped them no. on the side. No, it was an accident. Slippery grass. 
This is the last time I will ever bail you out of jail. First and last. I don't think I've ever bailed you out before. And you know what? Just as your punishment, you get to work a full shift at the warehouse. Well, I got a 12-hour shift in the old forklift, so this is going to be my day. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.